Opening this week brought to you by our friends over at AMC Theaters. Natasha, what is opening this week? Barbershop, the next cut. To survive harsh economic times, Calvin and Angie have merged the barbershop and beauty salon into one business. The days of male bonding are gone as Eddie and the crew must now contend with sassy female co-workers and spirited clientele. As the battle of the sexes rages on, a different kind of conflict has taken over Chicago. Crime and gangs are on the rise, leaving Calvin worried about the fate of his son. Together, the friends come up with a bold plan to take back their beloved neighborhood. Um, I saw this movie last night and I had never seen one of the barbershop movies too. Mm. And Mark was telling me he had seen the first one, he liked it. And I didn't know what to expect going in. I thought it was just going to be a pure kind of like, yeah. kind of like just joke after joke after joke. I'll tell you what, the, there was a lot of drama in it. The drama to me hit more than the, the jokes did. There were some jokes, that, it, it feels like kind of like, um, like a stage play at some points because there's a lot of dialogue and it's like there's a lot of you can see the blocking as where they're 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 going to hit their moments and then give their their speech and but I thought that it, the story to where Ice Cube is really wants to, to take care of his family now and wants to move them out of the, the there's so much violence happening in their particular neighborhoods so he wants it to go and it's like the relationship between him and his kid was what I really responded to and I thought that there were some nice like emotional moments that I wasn't expecting from this movie um but I thought a lot of the jokes kind of fell flat. I thought that Cedric the Entertainer was really good, and I thought Ice Cube was always great, but I thought some of the other side characters... Ooh, like Nicki Minaj? She actually wasn't that bad. Really? No, she wasn't that bad. Okay. I, and I went in kind of prejudging them. Ah, she's going to be terrible, because she was in that movie with... Uh, Oh, Cameron the Diaz. Other woman. Oh, my Lord, was that a stink bomb from Garbage Town. Um, so, the, but, but she was good in this. Uh, but the movie's okay. It's fine. Any interest? Sure. Yeah. All right. <laughs> no, I. You know, look. I they really... kill eight people in the in the barbershop, and yeah. now you have to find the killer. What? And his name is I don't know. I'm just trying now to make I'm a horror interested. film. Yeah. No, look. I uh, I love Ice Cube. I, I admire him a lot as a producer, um, and and I think that this franchise, you know, the fact that it's still going is really important. And I was reading a review uh, recently that said that it, the movie has a lot of social um, relevance as well, and I think that that's great. You know, it needs. Whatever they're discussing needs to be discussed. So I think it's very cool that it's coming out, and I'm sure it will do well at the box office. Yeah. Uh, Josh, Bikudu. I've always just been really jealous of how cool black barbershops look. Like yeah. I want to, to be able to hang out in those. Like if we had those in our neighborhood, I've seen both barbershop. I enjoy them. I'm, I'm a simple guy when it comes to comedies. Everybody knows that. Uh, I will go. I will probably. I won't go see it in the theaters, but I will. I will wait until it comes out, and I'll definitely watch it. Natasha, have you seen any of the barbershop movies? Or, or? I have a not, yeah. and I. Probably will not. It not just doesn't doesn't draw anything to me. I mean, yeah. I guess maybe I'd like to see Nicki Minaj in it because I like her music. But, <laughs> but no, but the I think I I was I, I I definitely was pleasantly surprised by the by the actual story and the emotion in the movie. Yeah. So, uh, hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.